Animoto provides numerous ways to share your video. In this video, I will show you the different sharing options, so you can choose the one that fits every sharing situation you may For the purpose of this demonstration video, I'm not going to actually share my video, so you will not see the product of the sharing. When you look at the video page, you should see the share section on the right hand side. By default, seven sharing options are listed, email, Facebook, Twitter, URL link, YouTube, embed code, and more. Okay, so really six and an ominous more button. Don't worry, more about that in a minute. So starting at the first option, email, if you click on the icon, a dialog box will appear where you can add the email address of the person you want to send the video to. If you want to send it to more than one person, add a comma between each address. You can also add a personal note if you want to. The next option is to share your video on Facebook. Again, simply click on the icon and the Facebook dialog box opens. Log into your account and follow the prompts to share your video on your wall. Sharing your video on Twitter is very similar to sharing it on Facebook. Simply click on the Twitter icon, log into your account and tweet the link to your video. Maybe you just want the link to your video to include in a print document, share electronically, or use as a link in a website. No problem. Click on the link button to see the URL for your video. Click on copy to clipboard. You can now paste the video URL anywhere you want to use it. Adding your video to YouTube may be the perfect way to share it. If you think so, click on the YouTube icon. You'll see a warning message telling you that the export process can take up to 30 minutes to complete and that you need to sign into your YouTube account before you can be export the video. Click on Begin Export. To if you manage your own website, blog, or use a course management system, you might want to embed your video directly on the page. You can do this by clicking on the embed icon. When the dialog box opens, you'll see some options for adjusting the size of your video. You can choose small, medium, large, or extra large. The numbers listed next to the, next to the sizes are the pixel dimensions. Once you have all of the settings the way you want them, click on copy to clipboard. Now you can paste the HTML code on any page that will accept iframe embedding. So you may be thinking to yourself, all of these sharing options are really great, but I like to share the things I make on Pinterest or Vimeo or some other social media site. Remember that ominous more button? It could be the answer to your dilemma. Click on the more icon to see the additional social media sharing options. Pinterest, WordPress, Tumblr, Blogger, Vimeo, Wistia, SmugMug, and LinkedIn. The process for sharing to any of these sites is similar to the Facebook and Twitter sharing explained earlier. Click on the icon, log into your account, and follow the on-screen prompts. Well, what if even after all those sharing options you still don't see the media site you like to use? Well, don't worry. There's one more way to share your video. It's not free, but it is good to know about. If you click on Upgrade to HD under the Settings, you can actually download an MP4 of your video by clicking on an Upgrade option. Now that you know all of the ways to share your Animoto video, get out there and share your masterpieces.